but that's just it. When you do something in the moment, that's your moment, and that's it. Because you that's have to wait now for another 20 seconds. Makes the C1 seconds. in the suits like the... Oh, fuck, what's the other one? I forgot. The, uh... Full Armor Haiku Shiki. That's what makes them more to this, because they have... A little bit autonomy to them. Yeah, the mobility goes a long way. Yeah, yeah the, no, the mobility, mobility and force but, but, injection. But, but. This thing has that too, but... It doesn't really mesh well with the way it's... With the beam rifle, yeah, but not with its main weapon. Yeah, I so I had to play with the it main more. weapon. I think is for a more defensive play. Like I can see the main weapon being for a defensive type of play. Like you know how the other suits are kind of stay backish. Plus it pierces. Oh no! I have to play more with it. Well, I'm going off them. I only wanted to see what the banner was today. I mean, um, it's still fucking dumb that it's activated so low health because it just... That, that entire last match I've only been able to do my dodge rolls once because every time I get low enough health, every fucking suit in the game can wipe me out in just one hit because of how low the fucking health is. Yeah, it's got the same health pool as the Dover. Mm -hmm. I feel like they should at least raise it up a little bit because it's a support specifically, so it's like Greek Gear 2 can counter it a little bit. I feel like they should stop <laughs> acting like Biosensor and Psycho fucking waves or whatever the fuck they're called or they're actual good skills and just fucking put something better on. Beacon overtaken. Game all is nearly fucking irrelevant just because of it. Yeah. I don't understand why the Frank they did that with the game all. Okay, so 5k, no biosensor. Well, I'm going off ledge, you guys enjoy your little, your few games. I don't want to see what the suit was, but now I'm not interested, to be honest, a little bit. Although I like 650, I hate 650. A support that requires the stand still, I just don't like standing still in 650. Spend, uh, spend upwards of 130 tokens from you. I thought this was just a curse with the fucking two stars, but nah, it's a curse with everything. The best fucking Of course, I planted a bomb. While everyone else is getting in his skills, I'm gonna spend it. And of course, having a shock damage is lame as fuck, too. Yeah, no, I will give you that, though, Dongo. If you want to take more advantage of the biosensor, you might as well just add more health, because the biosensor does have to be a bit too late. But what, what's the difference between the biosensor of the Zeta and the biosensor of the Desu? This is the same biosensor. Right, but what makes it different? I mean, 17k health. Okay, no, that's 17k with enhancement. So normally it is. Not 17. So, what I mean by that, right? Is that you can survive longer with the double Zeta bio um, enhancer, the uh, bio sensor, than with the uh, support one. But what makes it that way? Literally just more health. That's it. But that's just it. You don't even have that more health. If that's the case, then you can literally just slap on a. Let's say you see Zetas surviving so long on biosensors because they build for health with the intention of having that last long. If you but, if you build a fucking hyper mega launcher like that, you're risking defense for more health, and at that point, you should just put more fucking defense on. An ally has that's what I'm saying. Okay, yeah, you're risking the defense for health, but Zeta can't even add a lot of defense in the first place. No, the it can cover. get in, do its melee, and get out fast, and you want to know why it can get out? Because it has shock dampeners on its transformation. But this is the same argument we have with the C1. Yeah, the shock dampeners does it make I'm not it. making the same 
an argument about the C1 because I knew the fucking C1 was good from the start, and I'm not saying this one's bad either. No, 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 I'm saying that's what we were complaining about. We were yeah, complaining about the, the C1 dampener. wasn't going to be able to beat because it didn't have shock dampeners, and so it's just going to always get stopped every time. Only in the sense that if you try to escape with it, you're fucked, but I mean, you can still u utilize the weapon so long as you're at the fucking range you should be as a support in the first place. That's what I was saying. That was my defense on it. And the thing is, it's gonna work the same way with this too. As a matter of fact, I think it actually has more range in the transformation than a C1. That's it. The only thing is, with more weapons, it has to spend more time in that range. Yeah, it does because with the C1 you can do it uncharged, but with this suit you can't. I don't have it. Faster is more optimal than just having lots of fucking damage. Damage, but just not getting it out fast enough. Yeah, I got you. You're not wrong. Basically, your fully charged shot on the C1 can do 5k, but this suit can do um, 3k, but you have to stand still and then do another 2k, but you can do with the Zeta rifle, so that's, yeah, you see what you mean. The only thing, but the thing is, with the C1, right, is when you fully charge and then you blow your load, that's it. You're yeah, you sitting there for a good... Rely on the top of good Vulcans. Nah, your Vulcans are decent, not great. And on top of that, your hip guns, normally, you do the heavy stagger and three shot overheat. Or, if you're smart, you can do the two shot and then like just save it over and over again. But then you lose your range gameplay. And so you're gonna have to play even closer. But in this suit's case, you can kind of wait until the- It's more of a sniper than the C1 is. C1's more of an aggressive type of player. This one's more of a sniper, I feel like. Well, that's the point. I mean, it's 650. Everything's fucking aggressive. So a support that can play aggressive and keep it with still, the team. Is gonna... I still think it's fine. Like, even with, like, the survivability, like, I was in a match just now with two Q Mark twos, and, yeah, if they got in your face and they kill you, they, they can do that many That's and what so, I'm saying. The, the rest of the match just kind of felt normal. Like, the damage output was good. Like, the range control was good. It just felt like another support for, like, a little less downtime on damage. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm thinking. It's really just less lag between damage. Sure, it won't matter on that tier since everything at that tier already has melee. Like, if they're in your face and then they shoot you and then you go into biosensor mode. Yeah, it won't really matter. They're gonna downswing you, or they're gonna go into their melee, and their melee is gonna instant kill you. But at range, you just turn into a really slippery, hard little thing to kill. Now you have a double dodge roll, and now even when the raid is trying to rush you down, you can get away. Oh yeah, like I got some dude killed last match because I got like super stupid low. He tried to chase after me, and I just kept rolling around. Exactly. Overextended and then got booty screwed. <laughs> Cause then you can just roll out of the way, and then you can tackle to extend your frame, um, your hit frame, I mean your eye frames, and then boom, your teammate's probably gonna be there. That's assuming your teammate's there. You're just stalling at that point. But the C1 doesn't have. The, the thing is, you can live longer. Your survivability goes through the roof. But at the risk of you have to stand still to get out most of your, um, your high damage. While the C1 doesn't. So, they're both different as far as the, um, what you want. C1 is for more aggressive type of play, but the, this Zeta is for more defensive type of play. It's wait for them to come to you, then go to them. But you can't go to them. It's just not gonna be as effective. Like your beamer. Fucking base, fucking melee defense on top of the fucking balancers looks like it. They expect you to actually fucking get a nice work thing. I, I think that's it. just there. Cause imagine, um, what you call it? Imagine the melee defense is just there because Zeta. Zeta's melee defense is, um, what you call it? Normal Zeta? Melee defense is also 20, um, 